This is an autograph I got from uh, just before I end this video. Uh, I met the concept artist on Lord of the Rings, one of the guys called Polisani. This is like getting an autograph from Gandalf. She it is. This is like the most awesome thing a man like me could achieve. This guy, that's the guy I wanted to show. This, if you think about who this guy is, right? Yes, you're thinking the same as me, Brun. It's Brun right now. Brun is also like a rock star in the Tales of Death Man world. Look at him. Sitting there on his horse. All right, so this is how it looks uh, before we set up the studio in the 5th of August. We're gonna sit in a bigger studio together with uh, another studio called Copenhagen Bombing. We had several different cool options with other animation studio friends, but uh, that's where we're gonna sit and do the pre-production and start the production for the next season. It's gonna be exciting. But right now, I wanna show you how it is in the first couple of months. June and July. We're sitting here in my own home office. Looks like this. I have all the reward poster up there. Yes! Yes! Some comic ideas, plan, all the board game cards, beta, like small tests. We're sitting with the list right now and it's gonna be super cool, that board game. But also, um, this is... Yeah, it's cozy. Actually, it's actually a pretty nice thing to also be sitting in the home office a little bit. You can hear loud music and... Um, it has, it has another kind of vibe in studio, sometimes a little bit more serious, but also makes sense because you're more people in different teams. But um, let me just show you a little bit around, introduce you to the team we are right now. Hey guys. Hey. Hey. Can you just tell me a little bit about uh, what you're doing? I've just finished one of the videos, which is going to go up on the channel this Friday. And uh, then I'm going to start an, on a new video where we do some cooking. Uh, it's going to be very exciting with our host, Mikkel Mines. Oh. I'm doing a lot of different stuff. Right now I'm looking at some animation festivals that we're going to, uh, to send and submit to. Then I'm running for ink for the printer, because it's out of ink. <laughs> So I'm going to uh, look through the files and and gather files so we can organize for the fall when interns are coming in and when we are getting to work on the uh, Tales of Agrethrian, the new episode. So we need to categorize the different characters and uh, and make it easy to, to access. Yes, set up schedule um, and... Yeah, we're gonna f uh, find out how to to buy a server because uh, yeah, we had some problems yesterday. We had a USB that suddenly stopped working, and that just can't happen. So we uh, we have to find out how to back up uh, stuff, and I think that will be a server solution that we will find out how to buy and maybe even buy today. It's like the problem with. Um Mac and PC when you take uh, your files to Mac to PC 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 to Mac to PC. Yeah. It's basically like throwing your child into like cold water, then into warm water, then into cold water, then into warm water, then into cold water. You would think it would make the baby stronger, but no. <laughs> baby dies. Yeah, I think I'm the, the sinner here, killing the babies. Sorry, oh, yeah. yeah, because I have a MacBook instead of a PC yes. like everyone else. Uh, you know what, actually, I just thing. let's just throw this out. And here we have um, Ina and Clara. Maybe you can tell a little bit about what you guys are doing. Well, uh, we are working on post campaigning. We are taking care of all of our backers, uh, make sure our rewards get sent out. And if you have any questions, just don't hesitate and come to ask us. These girls are the reason why you all will be super happy. This is like the mothership, the base, they are super awesome and epic and I'm very appreciated and happy of their help and actually it's a funny story how we, we met each other because uh, their thesis is actually written around Tales of Lithran they've been analyzing the other campaign stuff again so they're like the power, the bosses if this was a game they would be like uh, the boss <laughs> Should I just tell you a little bit about what I'm doing now? Um, here we have the planning we have a little team right now Clara, Ina, Mikkel, uh, Nikolai and Kasper this is the planning just for June. This is basically the next episode, Tira's uh, episode. It's gonna be a Tira, for the ones who don't know. Here we have like different eggs, don't wanna spoil, but that's really uh, in the works right now. And I'm preparing the design package and the board game illustrations and the shot book. I'll make a video about that. But that's basically like um, right now, and there's a lot of meetings as well. 
But setting up the studio is the first thing. Hello, so uh, this is uh, Mega Minds back with a little update on how's it going on Tales of Lethran. So we've just started week two of uh, pre-production and um, yeah, let's just meet the team. So um, that's me, I'm doing a lot of different things. I'll show you some stuff in a minute. This is Loren. Hi. She's the reason why this whole thing can be put together and we can deliver uh, on time and know what we're actually doing. Like, uh, yeah, planning, uh, helping him to organize the workflow. Yeah. Uh, yeah, and make sure that everything is made on time and we have all the elements that we need. Yes. That's my job. <laughs> and it's a, it's a pretty amazing job she's done. When you see the like planning, you'll see exactly what we do in the different weeks and hopefully we'll be finished by the beginning of next year. We'll see. Maybe End I should. December, Michael. <laughs> <laughs> we also need to do well this uh, of course. stuff we do in the buffer. <laughs> um, we've also started on the board game cards. Uh, we're going like pretty crazy with it here so you can see like monica who's not here at the moment um we're doing some more graphic approaches so you can see uh, for example this one of wilhelm that's like a, a little illustration of how i imagine the board game will look that's gonna be cool yeah and we have some other ones as well let me just uh, like some feedback here this is like um, when we go over the different uh, cards, we like do some drawers. So I have Vito, we also have a little guy, uh, Brune, of course Brune, we love Brune. Then of course we have the script. This is the whole episode will be animating. All the different, there's gonna be uh, um, eight sequences, typical three acts, like the reward and the first hero. It's a very exciting uh, story, I would say, pretty, uh, it's fun, it's sad, it's exciting. It's also a little bit scary. Let's check out what the team is doing. Here we have Natasha. Hi. Can you tell us a little bit about uh, what you are doing here, uh, Natasha? I'm working on uh, the winner's artwork. Jesus. And uh, kind of making uh, it in into a bit more of the style of the show. Uh, so they can have their characters Maybe in the show, if possible, right? Finding their shapes and uh, character design and designing the outfit and... Uh. So for example here we have like the winners of the drawing competition and um, we're doing some like... Then first we have like uh, some little sketches of how we can um, transfer it into the reward universe or like Tales of Lethran. You can see she has a lot of cool references from both the Tales of Lethran world and the reward. Um, and drawing. Can we also see maybe a little uh, Tira sneak peek? I think this at the moment would be Tira, like, and I mean, uh, throughout some of the ages, mm -hmm. uh, as a kid and teenager, and like adult, young adult as well. Different stages of her life. Yeah. Super nice. Some of her as a kid. And, uh, these poses. <laughs> That's so good. Um. Some more poses of her, but younger, even younger. And we're also working on her trading session at this age. Mm -hmm. mm. Yeah, I love, uh, love these sketches. Yeah, thanks, Natasha. Here we have James. Hello, James. Hello. What are you uh, sitting with? I'm uh, I'm still trying to, <laughs> to get that worker on for the export script. Almost there. Yes. Almost there. Just uh, hopefully before lunch. So basically, basically what uh, he means with script is that we're trying to efficientize how we export the animations, so all the layers will come out um, ready to be composited and put into backgrounds. All these things. Normally you sit and do it layer by layer, export, turn off layers, delete some layers, make the naming convention a hundred times, it's so annoying. So right now we're trying to efficientize it uh, so we can be more creative. Yes. <laughs> <laughs>
Så jag är inne i klar. Hallå. Det är the uh, magicians, wizards who um, are making this whole Kickstarter campaign. We've been running in the spring much more smooth and uh, it's made my life much more nice because uh, we have been doing the post campaign making sure that all the rewards and gifts are coming out to you guys uh, and also make sure that uh, that everything is like in order online and we know who's getting what and all these things hi this is uh, lena um we're doing storyboards here and uh, can you tell a little about what is happening here we are now storyboarding the the newest episode and it's the part where Tira finds uh, Wilhelm first time after all the years. Yes. So it's really exciting. Yes. Like we know that uh, Wilhelm killed Tira's mom. But uh, we don't know what happened after that with Tira. So um, yeah, there's some uh, exciting drama happening here on the board. Come see a little. Uh, you can see uh, Wilhelm, Wilhelm go by again. Yes. She's squeezing the fingers. <laughs> so that's how far I got so far. Yeah. Good. And so uh, normally when we do storyboards, we go through many different takes. And we are in it now. It's going to be exciting to see how the animatic, which is the storyboards edited together with music, uh, yeah, when that's gonna be locked. I think we're locked in a month. Anna? Hello. Hello. You're also storyboarding? Yeah. How's it going here? I'm storyboarding uh, the very first scene where we sort of are introduced to Tira and she's training. And uh, she has like this <laughs> little dummy of Wilhelm that she slits the throat off. Oh, yeah, that looks great. <laughs> Like you that. play that again? Yeah, I am. She's training. It's kind of like flying in there and then she comes. <laughs> Cuts off, Wilhelm said. <laughs> as a bag. Yeah. <laughs> and then she like has a picture of him that she oh, like this is awesome. throws <laughs> daggers on. Yeah. And then after that uh, scene where she has a flashback. Yes. To what he actually did to deserve her hatred so much. <laughs> yes. <laughs> ah, that's yeah. going to be great. <laughs> Good job. Thank you. So that was a little update of how it's going in the beginning. Thanks for all your support and for following and see you soon. Far away, a thousand miles from home.